I'm so tired. <laughs> when has that not been the case? But today I'm more tired than usual. <laughs> I had to work. I don't want to use shit. I need to. I need to figure this out. Who the fuck do I want to? I have more fun with Tager. Like, I have less fun with Tager, but I also have more fun with Tager. <laughs> if that makes any sort of sense. It's kind of like, against 50% of the cast, Tager, I mean, I know what this, it, it almost sounds like it's like, oh, when I win, I'm having fun, but when I lose, it's not. But no, there are just some matchups. Kokonoi's kind of one of them, but Kokonoi, it's a bit easier to break through all her bullshit than it is some other characters. But there are a lot of characters that it's just like, even when I'm winning, I'm just not having fun against these characters. Um, but yeah, like, I had to drag a fucking cart that was like 300 pounds up this massive incline. Like, my, I'm done today. Like, and that, was the, that was the start of my day. That was the first thing I had to do. And I was done for the rest of the day, but I still had to work another seven hours. Fuck! I'm already done right here! Is that a good ender? I feel like that's not a good ender. How did I get hit by that? <laughs> I started to block high and then I stopped blocking high. Oops, I didn't even mean to do that. That was supposed to be 2C and it would have worked! <laughs> I hate when I get crossed up like that and I throw out 2C and I get 3C instead. Because I do, because I'm holding down back. And so it registers it as down forward. Nailed it. Nice combo, Nate. I agree! Fuck that up. That was meant to be overdrive. We all know- Why am I getting hit by this overhead? I figured that had to be a punish. There was no, like... I need to figure out how to properly punish that with everybody. But that, just that move... Like, there's no way that a move can put me in block stun for 84 seconds and then not be punishable. Like, come on. <laughs> Man, bad. That's innuendo for penis. <laughs> that's all I got. That's that's everything I got. I got nothing left in me. I'm always the best, D Coon! Always the best! Nobody can beat me. All those videos prior to this, the Tager Mirror matchups, all that shit. All those losses? They never really happen. That's just me pitying the world in general and deciding that they deserve a chance. I'm not losing for real. I only lose when I want to. <laughs> Fuck you, Hado King, for saying these people play their main, teaching me how to play a main. Tanger's not my main. I really. It's kind of hard to even say. I was kind of thinking about it. Like, it did make me think about it. Difficult to say I actively have a main at the moment. Like, I'm just dicking around right now. I'm not sticking with anybody. I have not spent any time in training mode with any of my characters. God damn it. Fuck. I forgot that was cancelable for some reason. I don't know why, so I tried to 360 it and then, oh, I tried to sledge that. I am just late on my reactions to everything. Oh, nailed it. Fuck my life! Oops. I baited it 
it out and didn't fucking punish it? I had block stun? Super flash? I did nothing! That's bullshit. Where's my backdash game? What? Suck my life is stupid. Oh shit. Damn, I'm so bad. That's a combo? Why is that a combo? Why was that not a counter? <laughs> oh damn it! What? I'm s I am reacting to that by crouch blocking. I'm totally gonna do this. Fuck my life. <laughs> so what I was gonna do, when I said I'm totally gonna do this, I wanted to combo Gadget Finger Rapid Cancel 360B. Because it's an unburstable kill combo. Um, you, you, have to, you have to hold that. There's nothing you can do throughout the entirety of it. So it's guaranteed damage, and that would have guaranteed a kill. Instead of getting that... <laughs> I didn't even get the fucking rapid cancel. I really need to learn that timing. That's something that somebody who mained the character would go into training mode to actually fucking do. GG's, d -kun. Oh, no. I hate not knowing. Nat? Type 2. <laughs> uh, that's probably one of my problems I don't actually know how the NAT system Functionally works in terms of how it interacts with Like I don't know if it impacts Connection quality I know that like Actually I don't really understand it Cause isn't NAT type one can just connect to anybody. It's just whatever. It's wide open. NAT type two connect can connect to one or other twos. I don't actually know if this is correct. And then NAT type three can only connect with other NAT type three. I mean, I don't actually. I don't know how that functions. I don't. That's as far as I'm aware. It only impacts who you can connect with and shouldn't impact the act actual um whatever. It just, but it just. The system itself doesn't, like, the existence of it does not make sense to me. I'm not entirely sure what it was created for. The wheel of fate is turning. Rebel, one, action. Hey! Hey! I'm not gonna lie, after seeing that 5C, I kind of just want to sit here and wait for it. And just win off of that. Okay, so that's still massively safe. Good to know. I hit him in between the second and third hits. Oh, I was kind of expecting reversal. Armor, please! What? I'll take it. What just happened? What the fuck just happened? I actually don't know. I'm the best. Uh, fuck. Y'all know what that was. I'm not even gonna go for the gadget finger with shit. just option selected me. Like, that legitimately option selected me. I got hit in recovery. God damn it! Oh, that's a counter. 
I didn't even recognize the animation. I think this is like the second Tarumi I've played in about a year and a half. I don't remember anything. Alright, let's see. He started with 6C. Every If he doesn't do it this time, it's gonna be brilliant. All I want for Christmas is actual armor. All I want for Christmas is an actual bag. Why did I roll? My dude, you are random! Why did that? That's a downward facing move that hit me. Why? Thanks, armor. Oh, uh, that connection makes me sad. I got bots. Tarumi's definitely one of those characters that kind of just like. I'll give him a two out of three. I'm okay with that connection. It's not great, but he knows. What up? I'll give that a two out of three. But, um. I, uh, unless he doesn't want it, because he actually he complained about the connection earlier. With somebody else, not with me. Um. But Tarumi's definitely one of those characters where, like, nothing he does is really expressly kind of... He's a weird character because everything he does is kind of... Sort of safe. But not really, it's just that a lot of his moves are kind of like... So, like, if I try to 360 punish something, but he used 5C, now he's in the air. And I get bopped by 5C, that kind of... Like, he's just he's this really weird character that's always been kind of difficult for me to wrap my head around and beat his block strings. In neutral, I'm cool. When I'm on offense, I'm cool. Like, both of those, I'm good with. But when I'm actively in block stun from him, I have never really known what to do. The wheel of fate is turning. Rebel one. Action. That was supposed to be fucking 5A. Which would have worked! I can't, isn't that a fucking charge move or some shit? I was even. I reiterate, my homie, you are very random. So that's what he does! So that's what it was last time. He did that, and apparently it's safe on block in overdrive or some shit, so he canceled it into- and That's what I thought after I saw the animation. It's like everything I do is proper. Oh my god. There's no way this is gonna- yeah, that was too low to actually function the way I wanted it to. Fuck it. I'm gonna go random. Okay. I can't get my shit to actually- to actively come out the way I want it to. Okay. <laughs> I totally knew that would happen. Matchup shit, ladies and gentlemen. I'll reiterate. You mad random. You need to, like, you can blow dumb asses like me up all day if that satisfies you. But, like, the moment you get put in a real match, ee, I don't know what you're going to actually do. Because, like, everything you do is punishable. I'm just a fucking dumbass. Let's go full Disgaea. Now, who do I play? I want to find these... I actually... <laughs> I want to steal people's yellow squares. Shit! It's Nate, not Nat! <laughs> I ain't no tiny annoying bug. Come on, son. 
But yeah, I just, I want to fucking, I want to steal somebody's yellow shit. Alternatively, I want this game to actually tell me what the fuck the connections are. I'm going to grab some fluids. For realsies, this is bullshit. Like, it just, I have to tell you, every single time, it amuses the hell out of me. Look how much this fuck just scrolling through this shit causes like the entire game to go at about half speed. Let me appear and you dude, you're gonna be there. I don't know if you're gonna like me calling you random, but you're gonna be here. At least it's not as random as this dumbass, stupid piece of shit online system that Blaze Blue got going on. This sucks! Just give me what I want. Please. Please. So those, those are both one bars. Like, this is so utterly pathetic. It really, like, to me, there is nothing more unforgivable than, like, having something that doesn't even work and not, Coco, and not giving a shit that it doesn't work. Because it's been like this since Chrono Phantasma, and they don't care. Why did I buy this game? Why did I support this shit company? Coco, come see me, please, hopefully, cross my fingers. Um, but yeah, it's just, I get the whole aspect, you know, bugs are gonna happen no matter what your best intentions are, yay, no matter what your best intentions are, bad connect, or bad connections, bugs are gonna happen, that's just, that's a, that's life in programming, but when you abjectly refuse to fix those bugs and you're just like yeah whatever it's fine it's unforgivable it's bullshit because ultimately everything you do regardless of your work this is why even when I am doing the most menial of work even if I am cleaning out a gutter somewhere that gutter is going to be the most pristine piece of shit, shit collector, in the entirety of the world when I am done with it. Because the status of that sewer grate, gutter, whatever the hell I was talking about, is a reflection of myself as a person. Don't know why that worked. He does like to jump a lot, I gotta be... I'm the best. Why? Just why? Just why? I'm stupid. And then I fuck, I'm such an idiot. Oh man. That really does. I'm hit holding barrier. Come on, Tater. This is nonsense. I'm actually angry right now. Detect. I'm actively angry right now. I did like four things that all would have worked. Two of them I fucked up, two of them didn't come out. That was supposed to be an atomic collider, and it actually would have been safe. Hold this damage, Nate! Oops. That irritates me. I don't know, I got irritated from the first round, and like... When I tried to hold the tech button and then I got counter hit, 
out of a reset instead of, you know, anything else happening. When I tried to uh, barrier block, it came out. I didn't react properly in time. Um, all that shit. Uh, it just sucks. Because I do actually, I do think Tager has an advantage against Nauto. Although, granted, a lot of it is kind of, like, it's not... How should I... Oh. How should I properly... It's not just, like, a clear-cut... Tager wins this, no matter what, but it's kind of like... If you guess correctly, Tager's options beat Naoto's options. That's kind of more how it is. But this just sucks. Like, if I can't even barrier block his charge shit in time, I'm not blocking Azreal online. That's not happening. This, kids, is why you don't play tired. This is the biggest thing. You'll notice your reaction times are, like, an entire second slower than usual. <laughs> it's just a bad idea. But that is the life that we live? Why am I even using this dude? Why did that reach me? I don't know why I bursted that. I blocked that. Okay, that's safe. I... Okay. I might be too far away. I played that horribly. Like, about as badly as I could have played that. I'm getting irritated again, because I feel like I'm blocking all these things, but again, it's that whole reaction time. Okay. Called me the fuck out. God did That too. That's, yeah, that's starting to really get to me. The fact that I can't do 360s on reaction, not because, not like it's anything. I don't that. Oh right, I'm gonna block some the entire time. I'm fucking smart. The classic. I mean, that should have been. That was stupid of me to eat that. And I'm probably gonna lose because of it. Never mind. I actually got lucky there. What am I doing? See, I'm dropping everything. Cause I don't, I get, I get a fatal counter. And I don't actually know fatal counter combos with Tager yet. What am I doing? Thankfully, it worked. That's, I should have just gone for that. Like that's all I should have done was go into Atomic Collider because it would have killed. But I went for like online gadget finger whiffs are always a bit of a crapshoot for me. It's never guaranteed. But yeah, it's definitely like the way I know that man why are all the yellow bars I'm not the yellow bars why are all the yellow players bad connections for me they always are I never have a good goddamn connection with the yellow icons I just want to steal somebody's yellow that isn't command throw because he'll steal mine instead <laughs> But yeah, the way I know that it's kind of like, alright, this Tiredus is actively impacting me. Is when, like, when he threw out that Hornet that won him the ra like the first round or whatever. I 
felt like, you know, like there was no way I didn't block that. There was no way I didn't block that, but I didn't. And that's kind of the first initial sign that like, yeah, your reactions are slower than they usually are. I basically just been consistently tired since before Christmas because about a week before Christmas I just decided like man I'm going ham on these energy drinks I'm just dropping them cold turkey and ever since then I have not stopped being somewhat fatigued come on armor help me out god 360s there we go. I made sure to actually hit the top that time. What the fuck? What the fuck? What am I doing? Hey, you can't answer here with that. Not against Tager. It's too... Uh, it would actually be better... For you. Well, actually, I don't really know. Probably better just backdash away and whip punish it, honestly. That's what I would do. I will you. God damn it! That was an interesting throw tech. I am an idiot! That was a kill! I am the G- Never mind. I'm the best! I didn't mean to even do that. Like, I didn't actually mean. How did he get to rapid cancel? Like, I thought I invincibility straight through it. I guess not. I can't believe, like, that was the, um, the sledge right there. That should have been a kill. That should have immediately ended the round. But I am such a fucking idiot, because I don't remember, <laughs> I never remember that you can't do, you can't hold down Exceed Excel if you're holding backwards at the same time. Barrier overrides it. And I do that, like, because I use Exceed Excel so rarely. It just always happens. And I need to stop. I desperately need to stop doing it because obviously that's not what I want. I mean, granted, it, thankfully I didn't waste it, I guess, because it wouldn't have won there anyway. Um, I did it a bit late in the block. If I had done it right when he started that Rekka, it would have hit him. But I kind of did it when he was almost in recovery from it. So it kind of saved me a little bit, but it's still... I need to remember that because i probably use it like once every 20 matches i would say i try to use it but i need to use it more often it's better than honestly it's better than using burst because you get damage and you get oki off of it and it's basically burst if you use it defensively essentially i don't actually know if that beat my 360 or 360 just didn't fucking come out there we go Oh, that sucks. I am an idiot. Of course that's not going to work when he's not magnetized. I should have that. I should have, um... I should have held it. God damn it, what is wrong with me? What am I doing? Cool. That's actually unsafe, I just did it badly. I didn't want that one to come out, god damn it. Why did I get hit by that? Why? Oh, okay, we're just not gonna jump. I deserve that. God damn it. I from the distance that that came out, I could have chicken blocked that, but I never got my the jump never came out. I'm not sure why. Oh, 
God damn it! Every single time I get a super jump when I'm in somebody's face, it's because... It's because I tried to 360. It's never an intentional super jump. Bitch! <laughs> I'm so angry at myself for all of these failed anythings. I was just constant fuck-ups on my part. I forgot you can't combo off of that one. Oh! I am so dumb. That should have worked. Okay. Oh, I'm stupid. Come on! Give me that! Oh! Give me that too! Give me that too! I am so fucking angry right now! Ah, uh, not actually, but god damn it. How many moves, like, every single time I said give me that, that would have been a kill. I should have known with the burst. I should have done something far better um, with that. With the uh, DP punish, 100%. Like, that was. I choked on that one. That one was my fault. But I was so. My mind was just gone from, like, everything in front of it failing. Please that is my biggest. Character. It's my biggest flaw. In. Uh, most of the time is I get my mind just blanks a little bit when something goes wrong and I kind of like I focus on that too much and it draws me a bit away from what's actually happening at that point and it, it does cost me matches it absolutely does I've lost I've lost casuals I've lost online shit I've lost tournament matches because shit like that happens it's definitely like one of the biggest reasons why I lose in general is because something weird will happen or I'll like I'll fuck something up that should have gotten me the kill, and then I just dwell on that. Damn it. The wheel of fate is turning. Level one. Action. We learned this. God damn it. Alright, he's getting DP happy. That sucks. That should have been a crouching confirm. Come the fuck on! Unbelievable! Yeah, he's getting very DP happy. I mean, it's my fault. I've been hit by basically every single one. Even the ones I try to bait out. Nice anti-air, Nate! Why would you do that and then press a button when I have a hundred meter? Like, of course, what else am I gonna do? You're magnetized, you're right next to me, I have a hundred meter, I'm magnetized wheeling. Alright. He does have a very consistent timing with his anti-airs, and so that's why I like J2C. Fuck my life! That is that is punishable, I'm, I'm not getting it. Why the fuck does this keep happening? I didn't mean to eat that. Oh! You see, I took myself out of the match and I got reset. Oh, 
but see how deep he happy he is? And there's no reason for him not to. I'm not trash talking him for that. He's hit me every single time because I'm not baiting it out. I'm going ham. See what I mean though? That is that is free. I'm just mistiming my shit. That was a bad move to shoot. Like, especially with how he's running his offense. See, I got Sledge right there. I am an idiot. I am a huge idiot. What came out? That was a free win for me, by the by. That was an absolutely free win. Because at the health he was at, with overdrive, I could have killed him. I don't know what came out. I was just holding barrier. It looked like 5C. So I don't know why. Like, I mean, maybe it was something else. I don't know what it was. Something came out that should not have come out. I have no idea what just happened right there. <laughs> I mean, I think I'm I think I might cuz I tried to I don't know how input detection works in Super Flash, so like I started to uh I what I tried to do was hit overdrive that's what i wanted to do but then once i saw he was doing scud punishment i just held barrier and it looks like it i don't know why it would have taken 5c out of that but that's what i saw the startup for there was nothing else that has that animation where he kind of pulls his arm back his arms back the way he started to but that just fucking blows i am losing matches that i have no business losing and that is the worst kind of loss. It's not like, you know, obviously if you just get straight out played, there's nothing bad about that. You got out played, you got to get better. But these are straight like, this is nonsense. What am I doing? His forward movement's a little bit predictable with Asriel. It's kind of like always goes back for like a second and then he moves forward again. See? Back once, straight forward. Come on, armor? armor if you're not even gonna make it function oh hello okay 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 I am an idiot I am a fucking moron That should have been a kill combo. I don't know why, because I just used Magnetech Wheel. This is the tiredness. This is the tiredness. I'm not paying enough attention. I just used Magnetech Wheel Rapid Cancel, and I thought, I can put him back in the corner, Rapid Cancel this, and kill him off a of 6C, 5D. Because, I mean, I'm pretty sure the 6C would have killed off of that, but just in case. And fucking sure enough, oh, I just used 100 meter, 
This isn't Persona 4 Arena, where you have 150 meter. Please select your character. Stupid mistakes like that cost you matches. God, this has gone on for 40 minutes. That's my bad. We're starting anew. 